All right. Well, hey, welcome to uh, rotation, preschool rotations over you for Lifeways 2020 Vacation Bible School Concrete and Cranes. My name is Cindy, and I will be showing you a few things that are in our rotation uh, packet for uh, your preschoolers this summer. Um, first off, we're going to start with our rotation packet. Uh, this is this is it right here. It comes all uh, in this one packet. And in it, you have um, three books. You have uh, your missions rotation, music rotation, craft rotation, and uh, recreation. And also you have, um, there is a music for preschoolers CD uh, in that packet as well. Uh, your snack recipe cards for your preschoolers uh, can, are there, they can be purchased uh, separately. And uh, they are in the kids starter kit for the grades first through sixth grade. Um, snacks that on your cards, they'll come in cards like this. Um, they'll, they'll be marked um, with the letters PF for preschool friendly. And um, so uh, the rotations resources are used to enhance each day's uh, Bible study. So everything that's in your packet, uh, there it goes along with each day's Bible study uh, for your preschoolers. Each rotation is designed for around uh, 20 minutes with a five minute transition uh, break between each rotation. But you change whatever you need to to fit your schedule, what's best for you. And your rotations can be uh, used in three different ways. Uh, you can use them in self-contained class, and that's where children and teachers stay in the same classroom all day. It's good for churches with limited number of teachers and space. And then um, also another rotation, teachers can rotate in and children stay in the same classroom and each uh, rotation teacher comes into the classroom to, to lead the activity. And that's good for with churches with a, a limited space area. Also, um, the last rotation uh, can be used for uh, rota the children rotate out. And rotation teachers set up in the separate classroom and uh, the children rotate out. And it's good for churches with a, a limited number of teachers. So that works well. Um, so bottom line, whatever works for you is um, how you can use your rotation packet. And um, so let's, uh, uh, since our theme is concrete and cranes, we're going to know our tools uh, a little bit better. So um, with our craft uh, book, uh, at a glance, just real quick, um, each day uh, th there's a craft. There is one that is related to the theme, and there is one that's related to the Bible story that reconnects that Bible story uh, with your craft. Okay, uh, you're, we'll come back. <laughs> okay. Decoration malfunction. <laughs> so... Okay, we'll go to um, our mission. No, let's see. Let's go to our music right now. And um, so our music uh, book, and I'll show you a little bit more in detail in just a second. Uh, it, you have your CD with your music, and it also has the motions to each of the songs for your preschoolers. Very simple, very simple motions and words. Uh, our uh, missions book uh, has a DVD that you will use. And... Um, so uh, that goes along uh, with your missions book, and we'll look at that in just a second uh, a little bit more. Uh, your recreation cards. Uh, these are great games uh, this year, but they come in a pack like this. And um, they'll have um, a theme-related game. They'll have a game uh, related to the Bible story. It brings that back to the Bible story. So whichever one that you choose uh, to use will be great. Um, so uh, just everything that in these in this rotation packet brings back to that Bible story, um, and that's that's what we're here about is to uh, make sure we we reinforce that Bible story in everything that we do, crafts, missions, music, recreation, whatever it is, it brings back their day um, to that truth of, of what Jesus uh, promised us in in our Bible and that Bible story for the day. 
All right, so we're gonna keep building uh, on our rotations packet and um, let's go back. We're gonna uh, go back and go look at um, the excavator missions. That's our name for missions is excavator missions. And um, so each day there is a short video. Here's your DVD um, uh, describing the work of missionaries. Um, day one and day two, um, showcase uh, Jorge uh, Santiago from Puerto Rico and days three and five showcase uh, the Worthy family in Italy. Um, this year's mission project is called Project Hands, Project Hands On, and it encouraged churches to collect work, medical, and food gloves uh, to donate in their communities. And there's also an option of financially supporting uh, Jorge Santiago and missions efforts in Puerto Rico uh, through the North American Mission Board through Send Relief. So that's all in your book and on how to do that um, in your missions book in the rotation packet. All right, so we talked a little bit about REC, uh, the recreation cards. Uh, this is called Wrecking Ball Rec. And um, there are instructions for both indoor and outdoor games on your cards. Uh, five cards include games with the Bible story connection. Um, others are themed games. And um, uh, I pulled out a couple of cards that I thought were really cute uh, for uh, your preschoolers. And, and it has at the bottom which card. Uh, it says like this says recreation card six. I pulled that one out and recreation card two. And so they make it really simple and easy instructions to follow. But um, the Wrecking Ball Challenge is uh, where you have blocks and um, paper towel holders and cups and you get a wiffle ball, tie a string on it, and, you, and they play the Wrecking Ball uh, Challenge. So that sounded uh, like a lot of fun. I think preschoolers would like knocking down some towers. Um, also in Recreation Card 2, it's called Construction Worker Says. And it's like Simon Says, and um, I think uh, your preschoolers will really um, like that. So I think that would be um, a lot of fun for them. All right, so then uh, our next one is uh, Bulldozer Crafts. Bulldozer Crafts, and um, there are three craft packs available. It's uh, the Barricade, Door Hanger, Jesus Loves uh, Mirror, and the Wise Builder Photo Frame. And uh, those are the craft packs that are available. Uh, but your crafts, um, th this is your leader guide, and um, these are for ages three through kindergarten. Um, in kindergarten for your um, preschoolers and um, some will be appropriate for some ages you'll figure it out of what what's easy for your preschooler to uh, make uh, there's a free art activity included in each day uh, that allows the children um, if you choose to do that on their own um, at least one craft ties back to that Bible story like we talked about um, before um, there are coloring pages uh, in the back of your book um, that you can some are theme related some are um, Bible story related so you can use those as your fillers uh, for your crafts for your kids and I will tell you that um, <coughs> you can check out uh, Nicole Corson <coughs> and um, she has done all the crafts all the preschool crafts and um, She'll have more insight on which crafts are great for preschoolers and which that you may want to uh, not use. But um, and you can practice your crafts as well to see what your preschoolers may like and enjoy on that. OK, next <coughs> is our Jack Cameron music and the music CD is in included. Uh, this CD is audio only. And um, so the DV ROM on the it's in the cover of your book. Uh, in your music book and uh, this DVD includes uh, all the uh, instructional and demonstration videos on uh, six of the seven songs and there are your motions in the back um, the teacher helps included on the ROM portion of the disc can be at accessed um, on a disk drive or downloaded using um, the code that's in your leader guide so uh, like I said they make it easy for you this the motions are simple for preschoolers the words are are, are simple the the song for um, concrete and cranes 
uh, obviously, uh, they're a, a little bit harder for our, uh, our first through sixth graders, um, but um, the preschoolers, theirs are, are more uh, simple. Um, on your worship rally for your preschoolers, um, you may ha already have a separate uh, worship time uh, for your preschoolers to attend than your older kids. Um, but um, I know we tried it last year for the first time at our church for our um, preschoolers, and they had their own worship time, and it, it was a great decision. Um, they're, uh, they're not with the first through our, our, we have first through fifth grade, so they're on their own, and I think they kind of liked um, having their own space and their own worship rally. And um, so that worked really well for us. So if you don't do that already, you may take a look at that and see uh, what works uh, best for you. But um, so that's about it uh, on our rotation packet. I hope this helps uh, you. And um, I will say uh, I've discovered this rotation packet uh, probably about three or four years ago. And I thought... Uh, my goodness, where has this been? <laughs> so, uh, and uh, so I'm thankful that I discovered that rotation packet. It is very helpful, and um, so um, I hope that um, your Bible school is absolutely wonderful of concrete and cranes um, for this summer with your preschoolers. And I will be praying for you, and um, I hope you have fun this summer um, at Vacation Bible School. <music>